Hello, Internet. Welcome back to the land of RuneScape. More quest catch-up. Today we're going to try the Gower quest, uh, which should be selected. Yes, it's selected. Medium to long. Uh, we may or may not finish this one today. But uh, we, we already have an unfinished quest that we need to turn in. Uh, remember the, uh, this one for Doric? The um, five Necronium Great Axes to be dropped off behind the gym shop at Falador? Well, off camera. <clears throat> I made them. Let me go ahead and remove the placeholders. But... Why did I do that? Because the first thing I want to do is to finish my masterwork armor, question mark. It depends on how... If, if I get one of these things where I get like a molten item and I have to like um, uh, uh, work through a progress bar, I'll just do it off camera. Uh, but I don't think that's going to happen. I've been working on this for I don't know how long. It feels like weeks. It may it may have been a month. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, masterwork armor. Then I got an enchant... Uh, not, not enchanted. Augmented. Do I have... How many powerful components do I have? I know I, know I need those for the... Uh, three. I know I'm going to need more than that. To augment it, uh, uh, that thing. Ugh... Um, uh, <laughs> Gonna have to make a lot of summoning pouches, I guess. Okay, masterwork. Finish that helmet. What do you mean I don't have an unfinished helmet? Oh, I, I apply rivets in my inventory. Okay, so apply rivets. Okay, I'm applying rivets. Okay, this is gonna take a while. Okay. So now, why do I have to finish after applying the rivets? Am I like welding the rivets or something? Uh, I, I, I may, uh, I may do the rest of this off camera. I wanted to finish my masterwork on camera because you know it's 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 a moment. I mean, I, I mined all the ores myself. I smelted the bars myself. I did all the hammering and folding and more hammering myself. I was listening to, to a lot of Lovecraft audiobooks while doing this. Uh. Okay, um... <sighs> okay. Okay, okay, just, just, we're, just, we're just gonna do this. We're gonna do this. We're doing it. Is there a way I could speed this up? Let's see, 140 some seconds. That's more than two minutes of this. Luckily, the plate body is gonna be the longest one of these. Oh, oh yeah, the, the, um, is this going to interrupt my task? Okay, I'm still getting XP, so I'm still doing it. Uh, okay, um, so the, uh, the, the spiritual enlightenment mini quest that's also part of the arc that I've already started, uh, I did have a little sneaky peek at the wiki, because I, I know she said go, go talk or fight some, uh, um, monks or something. I was just curious about, like, you know, what I have to do, what I have to fight, you know, what to expect in the fight. Apparently I have to fight those, uh, uh, like, Slayer monsters that are, like, there on the island, and I have to keep fighting them until I get three specific drops, which I think is going to be boring on camera. So I'm not going to do that on camera. Instead, I'm going to do this on camera. Oh, somebody's talking about the Hammertron. I should be using my Hammertron for this. Oh, well, it's, it's not even a lot of XP. It's like one XP. One XP. One XP. Oh, two! I got two! Okay, we're a little over halfway through this one. Luckily, this is the longest one. Although, the next one is 30, so that's 
<laughs> Almost as bad is the translation for that. And some dude feels like he's going insane trying to hit 99. Well, what do you think hitting 120 is going to be like? What do you think 200 mil is going to be like? Although, 120, what is 120? Uh, the remainder is 75 mil. My current XP is 28 mil. So that's more than 100 mil. That's more than halfway to 200. Oh, hey, I did it. Okay, so let's apply the rivets to the, uh, the legs. Why is there no master plate skirt? I mean, the skirt and the legs should be the same stats, right? I mean, shouldn't people have a choice? Let's see, what kind of armor is this, this, this person wearing? Examine. Cosmetic override. Oh, that that's that's not even the cosmetic armor, that's <laughs> That's a rune med helm plus three, plus three, plus three, plus three, and plus three. Okay. So that's what plus three rune looks like. Okay. Although that looks pretty good. I kind of want to, get, want to get some more uh, keepsake keys. Are they, are they still called keys? Slots? Maybe, maybe they're slots now? So I can like keepsake my um, uh, Elder Rune plus five. Because unfortunately there's no cosmetic override that looks like it. I think there should be. Like if you make, if you make a full set of Elder Rune plus five, which is an achievement, you unlock it as a cosmetic override. Maybe that should be a thing, Jagex. Okay, here we go. We're getting there. There's 20 to go. <clears throat> well, somebody received Archie, the archaeology pet. After all the years of playing this game, I only have two uh, skill pets. Gordy and Bernie. Hopefully getting 120 mining and smithing will get me those pets. Hopefully. Then again, RNG is never my friend. Okay, nine to go. Eight to go. Oh, it's the countdown. It's the final countdown. Okay, it's not actually the final countdown. There's more to come. It's the penultimate countdown. That was a less popular song. Two, one, and okay, so it's still unfinished, but it's riveted. It's riveted. Okay, so what do we do here? Begin project. What do you mean I like the requirements? I must be using an anvil. Oh, okay. Turn around, use the anvil. Begin project. Okay, that, that was odd. Oh, I got it. I can wear it. I can wear it. But there's more pieces to make. 500 XP. Yeah, 500 XP. Uh, okay, this is the weirdest progress bar ever. Okay, it's done. Uh, okay, and the legs. Yeah, begin that project. Yeah, it looks like I'm doing nothing, but trust me, I'm working on it. See, it's done now. Okay, the, the gloves. I, why do they put boots before gloves? 
I guess B comes before G. I like doing gloves first because the hands are above the feet in most cases. And now the butas. There we go. I got my masterwork. Isn't there supposed to be a set bonus or something? Okay, I, I, I gotta wear it. I gotta wear it. I gotta get a good camera angle. Uh, okay, let's go over here. It's less crowded over here. Okay, it's supposedly less crowded. Did I, did I just say supposedly? Okay, people are just popping up where I go. Okay, where? Uh, yeah, I don't want to trade it. Yeah, I don't want to trade it. I mean, I, I know it's worth like 70 mil, but I want to use it. It's like tier 90 power armor. Okay, let me see my stats. Not that I'll understand them. Uh, damage. Well, I'm, I'm using a pickaxe, so it's not going to do a lot of damage. Uh, oh, it's got a prayer bonus. Total armor. Almost 3,000. I don't know what that means. Um... Uh, damage reduction. Damage reduction. Armor bonus. I mean, it's melee armor, so I expect a negative on the magic. Uh, abilities. Damage... Oh, I guess that's what happens. Okay, yeah. Offhand. Main head. Where do we see the like the, the 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 power bonus or whatever it is? Power bonus. Power bonus. Power bonus. Is power armor? Where's the power bonus? I mean, yeah, I, I can look here. You know, that's plus twenty three, plus thirty four, plus fourteen, plus twenty nine, plus fourteen. But I don't want to do math. Could you mathify it for me here? Could you? Game? I mean, look, look, you have all this space down here that's not even being used. You could slide this down and then put a menu in between, right? You could totally do that. Mm. I, I get, oh, oh, there it is. There it is, weapon is zero, skill bonus is 247 strength bonus is 148 but is that is that adding in the bonus from the armor I, I, I don't I don't know also what does it look like I think it's uh, preset number four okay it's a little gaudy I mean, I, I wouldn't want to walk around wearing this, but I mean, I, it, it's okay. I mean, for, it's for fighting, so yeah, I, I get it. I get it. Okay. But, let's, uh, equip my regular stuff. My regular traveling around gear. Um, this goes in the combat stuff. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Okay, now... We do the quest. The quest that I started yesterday. And then... We'll do the Gower quest. I know, I'm taking forever to do anything. Welcome to RuneScape. It takes forever to do anything. Set him uh, Why am I going this way? There's a road over there. I guess it's a shortcut? Question mark. Go this way. Go this way. Surge. Yeah. Cinematography. I really wish that... Why am I going this way? Loss of controls. Come on, Jagex. Get on it. First person camera. Get on it. 
Although, admittedly, the game is not meant to be seen this close up. Okay. Continuing the quest that we started yesterday. Add items. Yes, add items. Okay, investigate. <clears throat> yeah, it looks like the place mentioned in, in the Nova Doric. You want to place the Great Axes? Yes. You place the crate, then retreat to a safe place to see who collects them. It's a ninja monkey! No monkey. Get away from there. Those weapons are dangerous. It's a ninja monkey. It knows danger. And it throws a banana at me. I got bananaed. Oh, my head. What happened? You got bananaed, dude. A ninja monkey bananaed you in the face. Investigate. Weapons are gone, but you find a note placed within the crate alongside some banana skins. I did it. Uh, okay. Investigate. The crate holds no more treasure. Uh, okay, do Doric and Boric have any more? It looks like no. So, okay, let's go to the Gower. Where's the Gower? There's the Gower quest. Let's go there. Talk to Andrew Gower at the cabbage farm south of Varrock. There's a cabbage farm south of Varrock? Okay. It's south of Varrock. Varrock. Ah, I still have a note. Oh, there's a monkey's note? Let me read the monkey's note. Thank you for helping further the, our cause. Your efforts have been noted. P.S. Sorry about knocking you out. No hard feelings? Okay. Okay, now, Varak. Summon that tree! <coughs> South of Varak. I know there are, there's a wheat field, I can see it. I know there are mines. Okay, the marker says go this way. Through the evil circle. This is a cabbage farm? I mean, I see cabbage. Well, I see some cabbage. There's not a lot growing. That's a master farmer. That's a master farmer, really? They used to look different. Uh, I guess I go inside? I guess I go inside more. Uh, hello. Um, Ian Gower, Andrew Gower, and Paul Gower. The Gower Brothers! They made the game way back in the day. Are they still affiliated with it? I, I don't even know. I'm not kept up with that. Okay. No, no, no. Let's, let's go over here. Stand in front of all three of them. Who are you? I'm the Lore Master. I was wondering if you had any quests for me. Oh, it's an adventure. Uh, in, like, in our game. A real one, though. You're in the game, dude. You're in the game. I'm not just any adventurer. I'm the World Guardian. It's, it's, it's in my name. The World Guardian. There. I'm sorry, but I don't know what that is. Oh, I accidentally skipped the dialogue. The music is a little off. It feels like some sound effects are backwards. Anyway, welcome to the Gower Farm. I'm Andrew. I'm Paul. And this is our younger brother, Ian. Hi. <clears throat> so 
So, about that quest? Oh, well, you see, the problem is, we're having is... We're cabbage mancers, right? Sure, that makes sense. But our cabbage patch has uh, stopped working. What do you mean, it stopped working? Cabbage aren't growing, is that what you mean? Well, no matter uh, what we do... Oh, well, no matter what we do, uh, cabbages are coming out of it. No cabbages are coming out of it, I, I, I a word. Did you rake it properly? Yes. Did you put compost? Yes. Did you plant the seeds? Yes. Did you water them? Yes, we have successfully grown cabbages in the past, you know. The you know part is, is feels a little... A little redundant? Sorry, that's the extent of my farming knowledge. Have you, uh, turned it off and then turned it on again? Have you tried unplugging it and plugging it back in? Well, that's your quest. Find out why the cabbage patch isn't working. Uh, okay. We've had word from other cabbage enthusiasts that it's uh, been affecting their farming patches as well. Do you have any suggestions? I have one. Okay, what is it? Cabbages. They must know all about where cabbages come from. If you ask them, maybe they can help. Okay. Why is my character saying that sounds easy? What's the catch? How do you talk to a cabbage? Do you know how to speak cabbage? Not really. Well, that sounds like your first challenge then. Okay, what should I do? I can explain to you at length the tasks you need to perform and have you report back to me after each stage so that I can give you the next one. Uh, or you could just give me a list. Or we could just let you figure it out yourself. I think it'd be more fun to let you figure it out. Quests are better that way. Don't wander too far, though. Everything you need should be on the farm. This is exciting! A real quest! Off you go! And come to us... Uh, no, and come talk to us if you want to know more about what we do. Okay. I gotta talk to a cabbage. Well, there are cabbages around. Um, is there something in here that will tell me how to talk to a cabbage? No. What about outside? I didn't want to do that. It's just like, it's like every game I've ever played, I close the door on myself. Uh, what is this, a cabbage distillery? You're making cabbage moonshine? That's what a cabbage mancer does. Um, why are those cabbages bouncing? Talk to Crispy. The cabbages are hopping up and down and seem quite animated. I can see that. Yeah. From his proud, authoritative bearing, the cabbage seems to be in charge. Uh, hello? You obviously can't talk to cabbages without wearing a cabbage speak amulet. Okay, how do I get one? Is the master farmer? Okay, I can only pickpocket from him. Does he have? Does he have a cabbage speak amulet? I wonder. But okay, and theoretically everything I need should be on the farm. 
quest. Tell me what to do. I need to find the components to make a counter speak amulet, with, which can all be found on the Gower farm. So far, I'm finding no items. I got a tree. I've got a water barrel. I've got... Ooh, i got a search water barrel. You find a single solitary Brussels sprout, perhaps a leftover from Windtumber celebrations past. Examine. Solitary vegetable, perhaps leftover from Windtumber celebrations past. Okay. Okay. The music is just off. It's so off. Am I missing it? That's, that's a book, but I can't. That's a dangerous place to keep a book. I can't read it. It's like a decorative book. Wait a minute, I saw something over here. Search a crate. Search that crate. Find what appears to be a piece of pure essence, but perhaps it's an upside down rune? Okay, maybe it's an upside down rune. We'll examine it. An uncharged rune stone of extra capability, or an upside down rune. Flip. You turn the essence over and see a strange symbol engraved on it. Could this be a legendary life rune? It appears to be so. Examine. The legendary rune appears to be true, but how did it end up here? And where's the life altar? Can I search these? No, I can't. That's a fill sink. Churn, dairy churn. Never mind. Oh, search this one. Nothing. Search these. Nothing. Search the scarecrow. I didn't do that. You find a strange cross-shaped amulet frame, sort of a cruciferous mounting. Examine. It looks like a cross-shaped amulet. Let's, let's use on the life rune? The melting has no um, gem in it yet. Okay, use it on the Brussels sprout. Okay, Brassican amulet's unstrung. I need to string it. Uh, sheepies. All sheepies. Unless there's a ball of wool somewhere nearby. Ball of wool. That's a fill. That's a fill. Let's search. I already searched that one, though. Ball of wool. Oh, ball of wool. Ball of wool. Wait, wait. Okay, that's that. I, I'm saying the search. There's a door. Spinning wheel. Okay, so I should be able to find wool somewhere nearby. Okay, we got the rat farm over there. They don't have wool. There are no sheep nearby. He said don't wander too far. I mean, it should be fine if I wander away far enough to get sheep. I mean, I mean, um, uh, wool. Just one wool. Just one wool. I mean, I did a quest for this way, 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 way back in the day. It's called Sheep Shearer. Hey, we're finally away from the creepy music. Now, where are sheep? I'm seeing cows. I don't need cows now. Cows don't have wool. Oh, I love this song. Sheepies. Sheepies! Yeah, I can't attack the ram. I mean, I can't attack the ram, but I can't shear the ram. Shear the sheep. Uh, 
but okay, I sheared it. Okay, we go back to the farm because there's a spinning wheel right there. I remember when this used to be a shortcut. I mean, it's a shortcut, but I remember when it was like an agility requirement. You had to like step over the thing. Okay, but we gotta we we gotta say goodbye to the good music and let the bad music return. Goodbye, good music. Okay, maybe it's hanging around. I'm okay with that. Spin. Okay, uh, use on the thing. What do you mean nothing interesting happens? use on this thing. What do you mean? Oh, it's not a ball of wool, is it? I mean, it's a ball of wool, but I, I string it with not a ball of wool. So what do I string it with? What do I string it with? Hey, guys. Oh, the bad music's back. Okay, guys. Can you help me with the quest? Didn't I say it would be better for you to figure it out for yourself? Yes. Good quests. Uh, no, good quests are better that way. Besides, you have your quest journal. Which isn't really helpful. Okay, so I need... Something that's like a ball of wool, but not a ball of wool. And it's here on the farm somewhere. Where? Why don't we go out the front door? Is there something in the front yard? Eh, I can't see because of the trees. Should I search the sacks? Wait a minute. There's a... Okay, that's a fake door. It doesn't actually go anywhere. Okay, I searched those. I searched the scarecrow. What if I what if I what if I search it again? Maybe there was more than one thing. Nope, nothing. Okay. Okay, playing hide and seek. I searched there. I searched over here in this corner. Corner, what you hiding? Nothing. Uh, what if I need like a vine or something? Where do I find vines? This, this is, I want to see something. Ball of black wool. Do I need black wool? Bow string, crossbow string, magic string. That's magic roots. Uh, but there's not like a tree farming plot nearby. And then yak hair. Spinning wheel fletching? Fungal bowstring. Tempered fungal shaft. Uh, okay, never mind. 
Uh. Okay. Uh, examine. Mounted Brussels sprout. Okay, did I thoroughly search the room, though? Is there an upstairs? That's nothing. That's nothing. That's nothing. The beds. It's a bed. And there appears to be no upstairs. Did I search the fire? That's a crate on the other side of the wall. Maybe search it again. Okay, it's empty. The air churn had nothing in it. Okay, the sink is for sinking. Okay. Let's go outside and search the farming plot. Maybe... Examine. Okay, uh, 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 uh. Scarecrow. Is the master farmer part of the farm? Am I supposed to pick bucket from the master farmer? I mean, we can find out. Pick pocket. Yeah, I'm just getting regular master farmer loot. Yeah, never mind. I said stop. Stop. Ow. Okay, yeah, the music changed over there, so, uh, I don't think that is part of the farm. Well, this farm. Uh, okay, so... I'm looking for a thing... See, fill water barrel is just that. Just a fill interface. What am I missing? I hate these Easter egg hunts. Counter. Counter. Crate. Counter. Warehouse shelves. Warehouse shelves, books, warehouse shelves, spinning wheel, examine it, use your spinning. Okay, let's, let's, let's zoom out. Okay, we found a thing there. We found a thing there. We found a thing there. Um, oh okay, yeah, we found a thing there. Where have we not found a thing? In this room, but there's nothing to search in this room. Uh, door. Am I supposed to chop the trees? Because they are on the farm. I'm just getting logs though. What about this one? I'm just getting logs. That's it. Okay, so I don't think it's the trees. Is the rat farm part of this farm? I don't think it is. Is there something I can do with this? Nothing interesting happens. Okay. What if I use this on that? Not the right time to use the rune, okay. So I have to string it. But this doesn't work. Do I need a black string? Uh, okay, we, we, we gotta find out. Is there a shortcut that I can take to get over to the other side of the river this away? 
jump over the fence. And, uh... River. There's a bridge over there. Okay, I guess I gotta use the bridge over there. My character doesn't know how to get there. This is the shortest path to the bridge, dude. No, it, trust me, it is. It is. It is. Trust me. My character's an idiot. Okay, let's go the long way. Look, you could totally walk through there. Totally. See, you could, you could squeeze through there. That's easy. Okay, sheeps. Okay, yeah, going the long way again. Okay. Just going the long way. Just going the long way. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Okay, let's shear the black sheep. Okay. Wait a minute, let's, let's get there faster. I think, let's get there faster. I think this will be faster. Maybe not. But it's less me telling my character to go one way and having him go the other way. So we gotta, let's see. Zenoe Bonsai says, do you have to use a die? I have no clue. I'm trying to figure this out without having any, any clues whatsoever, and my phone is not keeping up with chat for some reason. Let's try this again. Close. Reload the stream. There we go. Okay. Uh, and go back in. Go back in. Make some black string. Black string, yeah. Okay, does this work? Nothing interesting happens. Okay, so it's not the black wool. It's not the white wool. Okay, they, they said everything should be found on the farm. But where have I not searched? Quest journal, tell me. Which can all be found on the Gower farm. Which I'm assuming is from this fence, around this fence, around here and around here, and is not including the rat farm. I don't think the rat farmers. Uh, okay, open this door. This room has nothing I can search, I think. Unless it's really, really tiny. Like, I mean, can I, can I search in there in the crack? I mean, I, in the real world, I would search that crack, because it could have, like, something, like a water barrel. Like, it could be hiding a water barrel, which is actually on the other side of the wall, but... Uh, the beds are nothing. The books are nothing. The chair is nothing. This cabbage is nothing. It's cabbages. Just a pile of magically created cabbages. Uh, this. Yeah, they're doing moonshine. They still for fractioning oils? What? What are you doing with oil? On a cabbage farm. I didn't know cabbage had oil. Uh, okay. Shelves. Nothing, can't mess with the candle. That's a door. Let's open it. Make it drafty in here. Wait, wait, what? Okay, that's an oak on the outside. Uh, the book I can't mess with. Another particularly opinionated page. Okay. More books. The crate is on the other side of the wall. Counter door. Counter door. Okay, 
empty. I search this crate. And, and then it is empty. These I can't search because I can't get to them. Although, honestly, I can reach that. I got long arms. Fill sink. It is it's just a regular old fill sink. Auto churn, uh, dairy churn is a dairy churn. Table does not even exist. The chairs do not even exist. Uh, where, where, where? I hate quests like this. The trough does not even exist. The sacks exist. I wonder if it's a sack boy or a sack girl. What? I, I get the feeling that's a reference to something, but I have no idea what it's a reference to. Okay, um, <clears throat> storm cellar door, yeah, nothing could happen down, nothing bad could happen down there, and I can't get there because I can't even open it. Hay bale, fancy rolling the hay, is that a clue? I mean, I can't even jump into it. Am I supposed to use something on it? Oh, what if I'm supposed to use something on a thing? And I don't have the thing that I'm supposed to use on the thing. What thing would I need to use on a thing? Uh, I, 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 this crate I searched, right? And nothing. This crate I searched, and I find nothing. I searched the scarecrow multiple times. left to collect. That's not part of the farm. Uh, I can't do anything with the cabbages yet. Because I don't have the cabbage speak amulet. Search the water barrel. I already did that. I found a thing. There's nothing left in there. This is just a regular old that. The bench. You see this game? You have me right-clicking everything. Some empty glass. Oh. Nothing but logs there. I wonder. Let me... go to a bank. Excuse Barthorpe. Get an empty glass vial. Because I want to see if I can mess with that still. It's like the one thing I, ha I can't interact with right now. Maybe if I could pour off some oil or whatever is in there, cabbage moonshine. I mean, you know what. You know it's cabbage moonshine. There's the bank. There's the bank. Uh, no. Empty glass vial. Okay, let's go back. My luck, this is a dead end. But, I mean, we gotta try it. You can't know if you don't try. Go, run, run, run now, run. Surge! Yeah. Yeah, go this way. So what is that icon on the map? Okay, well, let's, let's uh, use vial on the still. Nothing interesting happens. Okay, I knew it. Dead end. Uh, what is that icon on the map, though? Oh, dairy churn. That, that's supposed to be a dairy churn? I guess it's like a pitcher of milk? I guess that makes sense. And what else? The farm is like here. What have I not searched? Side. I, mean, I found nothing in here. Found stuff over there. Stuff over there. Over there. Out here. Well, here. 
Uh, I mean, if, if, the, if the items were evenly distributed, I'm missing one in this area. That, that's like how probability works. See, now I'm overthinking things. Also, why does this room have nothing I can interact with? I, I guess it's like... I guess they did that to emphasize there's nothing here. Stop obsessing with it. Don't look here. Uh, but I've, I've messed with everything I can interact with. Uh, examine. A beardy cabbage mancer. Examine. A tall cabbage mancer. Examine. A young cabbage mancer. That's the crane on the other side of the wall. Counter. What's the counter? Strange chemicals. Oh, this game is making my head hurt. Strange chemicals. Well, wait, what? What? Okay, that's just a regular dimpling. Well, let's grab it. Yoink! I got junk. <laughs> Uh, security guard. He wandered in here. I don't think he's part of the quest, though. Uh, lamp? Other lamp. Oh. Bench. The bench doesn't even exist. Glass jars. Some empty glass jars. I mean, you'd think that would be a hint, right? It probably isn't. Uh, okay, zoom out. Uh, uh, yeah, th that, that doesn't help. There's just a fill barrel, fill barrel. I've already searched that. Examine. Disturbingly manlike, uh-huh, yeah. Examine? Yeah, okay. The chair does not exist. Counter has strange chemicals. Oh. Obviously, I need a string for this. How to make string with stuff on the farm. Uh, spin spinning wheel. We got that, 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 we got that. This is, no, wait, this is made with sinew. Or oak roots, or willow roots, or maple roots, or you 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 roots. Uh, maybe I kill an oak tree until I get the roots? Question mark. Of course, that's not how you get the roots. Okay, I'm going to have to burn some of these. Oh, well, okay, now it's stump. Examine oak stump. Uh, yeah, that's not going to give me the roots. Because that's not how you get the roots. Um, let's go back to the spinning wheel. Uh, rope is too much. Magic string, I need magic roots for that. This one need flax. There's no flax around here though. Also, that's a bowstring. That's what is this spinning wheel fletching? A tempered fungal shaft. Anything else I gotta do with this? I know he gets sinew by somehow cooking meat, I think, but there's no place to cook in here.
Unless I actually do have to make a fire. Okay, let's test this out. Let's go get some rat meat and cook it to make some sinew. I think that's how you make sinew. I should probably... Well, hold on, hold on. Let me look this up. Cooking. Um, meats. It's like a low level thing, so I gotta go up. Sinew. Well, okay, that tells me nothing. Okay, kill rat. Bam! Yeah! Okay, take the raw rat meat. Uh, craft oat logs into... Craft oat logs. Oat? Oak. Oak logs with a tinder box to make a fire. Okay, use the raw rat meat on the fire. Make sinew. Sinew? Sinew. Other recipes. Sinew. 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 Can I only do that on a range? I'm not saying sinew. Sinew! I see no sinew. What is this? Primal feast. Primal dessert. Primal main course. What is that? Oh, you gotta have all, all, all the uh, red onions. We got red onions in here? Oh, dude. I guess this is Anacronia stuff, because Anacronia stuff. Cannibal cabbage, sweet potatoes? Rainbow sweet corn? Okay, I'm getting distracted. <laughs> also, how much does it heal? It doesn't say. Heals 23,000. Um, the rock tail is... Oh, it heals as much as rock tail. I'm getting distracted. Uh, okay, so they said don't go too far, but I need to test something out. I need to find a cooking range. Because I think maybe that's how he makes sinew. I don't know. I don't think a crossbow string would be what I need. Cooking range. Cooking range. It's amazing how many houses out here don't actually have a cooking range. It's like the uh, map designers uh, designed this like a modern town where everybody like orders Uber Eats. Cooking range, where are you? Wow, nobody out here cooks, really? Nobody. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I, I know there's one in the castle. I know that much. There, what? There it is. There it is. Go there. Go there, dude. Sinew. Sinew. In you. Oh, it's raw beef? I'm gonna use the raw beef. Okay, let's, let's cook the rat meat. And then punish ourselves by eating it. Oh, nom, 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 nom. Okay, so very possibly sinew is not the correct choice. Let's go back to the farm. Very slowly go back to the farm. Okay, yeah, yeah and, and have just trouble deciding which way to go. Surge. There we go. I mean, yeah, I could kill a cow and go back and try the sinew thing, but... I don't know, I mean, there, there are no cows near the farm. I'm, I'm supposed to complete the quest on the farm. That is supposed to be how it's done. I mean... What am I missing? I'm missing something. Uh, 
Okay. I can't extract anything from this. Still. Uh. Search there. Search there. Search those boxes. Search it out here. Where have I not searched? There's no upstairs. Maybe it's a unicorn horn. I don't think that's it. Let's use this on that. It's not the time. It specifically says it's unstrung. That means I need a string, but... What to use for the string? What if I use this... On one of the dudes? Nothing interesting happens. Okay. So you're telling me nothing. Ooh, what if... What if I use it on the head cabbage? Use on the head cabbage. Nothing. Use it on the scarecrow? Nothing. Uh, use it on the still? Saw something about food. Food? What? What? There's a thing on the other side of the farm? You said don't leave the farm. This is not part of your farm, because this is not cabbage. The game lied to me. Dig around the trough, find a tough, stringy broccoli root. The game lied to me. I feel like this trough should be somewhere actually on the farm. This is not on the farm. They're not rat farmers. Lies! Lies! Okay, what am I supposed to do with it? Can I just, like, use it directly? Okay, no, I'm, I'm supposed to spin it. Make it into a string. That's what the spinning wheel is for. Okay, now use on the thing. Okay, I use with the life rune. As you add the life rune to the amulet, it transforms from a brassican amulet into a cabbage speak amulet. Okay, and I guess I'll wear it. Mmm, stylish. Oh, it shimmers. Okay, we're finally making progress. Okay, head cabbage, what do you gotta say? What is of want? Party hats. When be of want? Right of now. Uh, hello. Gasp! You as of speak? I guess so, yeah. It is extraordinary as human as of speak. I'm an unusually precious specimen. What to be of helping you? I want to know why the cabbage patches aren't working. Ka! Cabbage man says B of send you. No! Uh, maybe? Me tell you. We into riot. We into riot until we is of want. What are you writing about? What do you want? What is of want? Party hats. That into rightness. We is of want hats of party. We leaf, we chief. We leaf, we chief. Okay, they kind of want some party hats. You got some expensive taste, man. Uh, cabbage. Dudes. Hi guys. Oh, so how are you getting on? Yeah, I spoke to the cabbages. They're riding because they want party hats. Party hats what? 
You know, paper crowns like the ones you get in crackers. But that makes no sense. Party hats are just worthless pieces of paper. Yeah, not in this world. Oh, you need party hats. Yes. You are in luck. I have some right here. Uh, what color? Uh, what color do they want? What color is puce? And why would somebody name a color puce? Uh, I guess puce? Oh, I only have pink ones left. Uh, what'd that do? Can cabbages see color? Oh, good question. Not very well, I think. And pink will do. That's purple. It heads you a pile of pink party hats. They're purple! I think you're colorblind. Here you go. Okay. My luck, they don't want purple. Hi. You bringing your party hats? We leave, we chief! I have them right here. Yes, is a party hats now. Is making much bank. Uh, will you help me now? Wait. First, we must be of changing. Some privacy, please. You not be see leafy bits. You hand over the party hats. You close your eyes and turn your back. Yay, is a party hats. So are you gonna help me now? Oh yes, I am helping. You're probably thinking of cabbages be a vegetable, yes. Yeah, I mean you are vegetable. Yeah, cabbages are the cultivar of the species Brassica oleraca, a species which also includes vegetables such as Brussels sprouts and broccoli. Haha, -ha, me think so. That into completely wrongness. Cabbages be a pure magical fool. Like hippogriff or platypus. Platypus isn't magical, it's one of those egg laying mammal things that's not quite reptile and not quite mammal. But it's fuzzy. And it has stingers. So, really? Uh, I think he's lying. Yes, cabbage come from here, from other place. Other place? What other place? Behind sceneries. Place find under cabbage patch. If cabbage not grow, problem in behind sceneries. You go there. Under the cabbage patch. Can we dig down into it? No, that not into working even for human of speak. Only one way for into behind scenery's old trick. Be of needful disc of returning. Wow, do those things even exist anymore? Space. That sounds like something Andrew Gower might have. Be of picking me up. We go much in together. You pick up Crispy the Cabbage. Hi, Crispy. Okay, I need a disc of returning now. Hello. Yeah, the cabbage told me that to find out why the cabbage patches aren't working, I need a disc of returning, whatever that is. Yeah, they haven't existed for over a decade. What was that all? I can give you one of those. Andrew hands you a weird looking ring. It is spongy to the touch. Okay, good of jobs. Now I need to go to Minor Dwarves. Go, go. How do you know where we need to go there? Journal of Quest Keep in into Backpack. Be of reading it. Oh, clever. 
this. Is this oh, oh, yeah, yeah, he's right. That's where we need to go. Dwarven mines. That's near Falador. I should probably get rid of my oak logs and my wool and my unnecessary seeds. Okay. Hold on. Let, let, let me get rid of my logs. Fire! I can't light a fire there. Okay, let's go over here. Fire! Yeah. Bonfire it! Yeah. Yeah, why is this guy just making a bonfire right here by the uh, lodestone? You know, adventuring! I'm adventuring! And I gotta clear out my inventory. Okay. Here we go. I forgot how slow this is. Okay, here we go. Surge! Bam! Yeah! Oh yeah, I got some invention levels. I need to go in there and uh, unlock some stuff. Not right now. We're on a quest. Okay, Dwarven Mine. Okay, now where the Dwarven Mine is supposed to go? I need to travel to the Dwarven Mines and use the disco returning to locate the entrance to the behind the scenes. Okay, so I guess we go over here and then... Scan. It's cold to the touch. You feel a pull to the approximate southwest, so that way-ish. Let's scan again. It's a bit warmer. You feel a pull to the approximate west, so over this way. Scan. It's very hot. It begins to shine. You sense that you are very close. You feel a pull to the approximate southwest. Oh, that rock right there, that looks kind of funny. Scan. The disc of returning appears to fail while you have a follower out. Oh. Oh. Okay. Goodbye, little Miss Gloop. This miss. Scan. Oh, it's all white and bright. Ow, my eyes. The disc of returning becomes very hot and bright, and a bright light shines from it, blinding your vision. Yeah, I feel very blind right now. Here comes smell hole. B of jumping in. Here goes nothing. You feel the world start to fall away from you. This of black hole experience. Very close to behind the scenes. What do I do now? Look around, baby. I not know. This nut of cabbage path. If you want to return to surface, use use black use back of returning disc. Back of returning disc, what? Oh sleep now. You figure out rest. Uh okay. I can't even rotate the camera. Uh there Search the scary wispy thing, okay. You reach up, then quickly pull back scared. It feels like a spider web, and it felt like there was something large still in it. Ew. Search table. You search the table. Someone left their pet rock there. Hello, pet rock. Scary, wispy thing. Table. 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 
Wall. Search the wall. As the rock hits the depression in the wall, you hear a grinding as if something just opened. I wanted to search the wall, not hit it. Search wall. A nondescript bit of wall. High up, you can feel the edges of some sort of depression, but you can't quite reach it to feel what it does. Okay, I gotta find another thing. Search the table again. Nothing. Maybe there's something under it? Look under the table. You look under the table and find a basket filled with oranges. Do you want to take an orange? Yes, it seems so. There's a table there and a table here. Okay, I guess it's a really big table. There's the scary wispy thing. Oh, bumpy wall. You run your hands along the bumpy wall. You feel a hole in one of the grooves about the size of a key. Okay. It's that wall. Search unusual shape. Moving your hands over it, it feels like a skeleton. Ah, it seems to be missing its head. Anything else? New shape, wall, table. The table keeps shimmering. <laughs> Scary, wispy thing. Bumpy wall. Why does the table keep shimmering? Maybe there's something under it. Look under table. Uh, oranges. I keep taking oranges for some reason. Search wall. I uh, can't quite reach it. You get a right click. Bumpy wall. Scary wispy thing. Search it? Because now I have oranges, right? There's something large still in it. Maybe it's a key? What if I use... No, don't eat the orange. Use the orange... With the scary wispy thing. The orange is too wet to light. What? The orange is too wet to light. Am I supposed to light the thing on fire? I mean... I do have a tinderbox. What if I... Remove the tinderbox. Remove tinderbox. Remove tinderbox so I can use it. Remove so I can use it. What is that? Infernal puzzle box. So what? Shears. Can I cut it? What is this? Tongs. Enhanced grappling hook. I might need one of those someday. But, uh, I mean, tinderbox. Light the thing on fire. Use tinderbox on it. Settings? No, that's not it. Tinderbox. Remove tinderbox from tool belt. Examine. Passing under this, you feel it brushing against your skin. Can I go this way? No. Bumpy wall. Examine. I mean, yeah, exam something unusual. Table. Examine. Useful for putting things on. Search this wall. Completely normal wall and doesn't deserve any more attention. I don't know. There's a thing, right? There's a thing on it. Nondescript bit of wall. High up, you can feel the edges of some sort of depression, but you can't quite reach it to feel what it does. 
an unusual shape, examine unusual shape. You really don't want to touch this. What if I put an orange on the head? You put the item on the skeleton of her head, but it doesn't really look very good, so you take it off again. Uh. What if I put crispy onto the unusual shape? You put the item on the skeletal skeleton of her head, but it doesn't really look very good, so you take it off again. Okay. Ball of wool? Yeah, okay. Quest, tell me what I'm doing. I need to work out how to get to the, out to the other side of the black hole experience. There must be something in here to help. Uh, something in here to help. Crispy, help me. You need to be finding a way out. Be looking around. I'm looking, I'm looking. Search the table. Maybe there's something under it. Let me guess, more oranges. Yeah, more oranges. I took one. <laughs> Examine. A common fruit. Eat? Okay, I found a key. It tastes bitter, so you spit it out. Uh, okay, so bumpy wall. Bumpy wall had the keyhole. The panel slides back to reveal a tinderbox with a quest icon embossed on the lid, which you take. Yeah, that has a quest icon on it. Okay, now scary wispy thing. A skull falls from the cobwebs as they burn away. Take the skull. Unusual shape. Okay, so the sparklers are telling me that I need to look at a thing. You return to the head of the skeleton as you do, it crumbles to dust, and a voice seems to hang in the air. Log in? Log in? Runescape is loading, please wait. Log in. Welcome to Runescape. Enter the gate of Log in. Uh, hello? Thorder. I guess we talked to Thorder? Oh, hello. I wasn't expecting anyone today. Welcome to Behind the Scenes. Uh, welcome to where? Behind the Scenes, laddie. Rune skins home away from home. I don't understand. Ah, your first time here, is it? Don't worry. Uh, we'll soon get you sorted out. So which is it? Graphical Weaver? Uh, dead content? Uh, were you killed off in a quest? Or you, uh, unreleased content? I'm not any of those things. I'm an adventurer. Oh, right. Well, look. Uh, I had to put something in the box. It's for record keeping, you see? Uh, so just pick one. Um... Uh, I guess I'm dead content. I see, I see. Very good. Well, uh, if you step on through, uh, you can meet the others. What is this place? It's behind the scenes. Placeholder. Hilarious placeholder dialogue here. Wait, what did I just say that? It's the editing. Uh, there's uh, no one checking the dialogue, so you just spew out any old rubbish. Placeholder. The player still doesn't understand. Uh, uh, that feels horrible. Don't worry. You've probably gotten it out of your system now. You may still find yourself saying some pretty weird things, uh, though. So what is this place? 
I'll break it down for you. You're from RuneScape, right? I'm from Gilenor. Sure, a uh, big rebranding re exercise, world building, same thing. Sometimes in RuneScape, things change. People change, how they look, new stuff appears, old stuff disappears. Yeah, like the Duel Arena. I've never noticed this happening. You didn't notice that the Duel Arena is now Hits Oasis? You're part of the system, see, so you don't see it happening. Uh, take the Rat Pits. You remember the Rat Pits? No, what Rat Pits? I remember the Rat Pits. It was a mini game, and it was broken, and no one played it, so it got removed. So now for you, it's like it never existed. But what does that have to do with this place? Well, when something gets removed from the world, or before it gets added, this is where it goes. We call it behind the scenes. Just, uh, look, just uh, think of it like the afterlife. Afterlife slash theme bar. So it's full of dead people? Close enough. Go on in, you know, you'll either figure it out or go mad with the trying. Okay, I'll go off then. So, Varega was here? Level 10,000. Guthix? That's not what Guthix looks like. Okay, that is kind of what Guthix looks like. Ooh, the God Wars uh, uh, commanders, generals. Who, who, who's up on this side? Beast Master of Jerzak. I thought he was bigger. We got the Chaos Elemental. Romeo? Yeah, they removed that quest. Tim? Crunchy? I thought Crunchy was a YouTuber. Creature, 9001. Environment artist. Okay, we gotta talk to all the people. Uh, do I have a map of this area? No, I don't. Okay, so I guess... We start here and go clockwise? So that means going this way? Let's talk to Tim. Some call him Tim. Eh. You want to talk to the spider first? I want to talk to the spider first. What? Crunchy. You want to talk to the spider first? Okay, I guess I want to talk to the spider first. The Spiral Orb. Hey, you! What? I know why you're here. I've noticed the cabbage patches aren't working, and you trace the problem here. How could you know that? I've watched a walkthrough video. A anyway, hi, I'm Spiral Orb. Welcome to Behind the Scenes Pub. Uh, have we met before? I don't think so. You're Minstri Webb. You did that sweet set at Death's House a few years back. I don't remember that. Was that during my six year hiatus? Oh snap, no way. Did you see me there? Yeah, but you were a bit terse with me, to be honest. I don't remember that. Oh, I'm sorry, I was in such a mood that year. Nothing to do with you. So you're calling yourself Spiral Orb now? You seem to be talking about differently too. Yeah, I don't remember what voice I gave that character way back then, if I even met the character back then. Oh yeah, that. I was a, it was a, I was a bit tragic then, wasn't I? So anyway, what were you saying? Cabbage Patch. Oh yeah, that thing with the, th the thing, yeah. I'll tell you what I know. Something is wrong with a life altar. The life altar? Yeah, the life altar in the basement. The legendary life altar is in the basement? Yeah, in the basement. Problem is, it's broken. 
It exploded or something. Pieces flew everywhere. I've heard a few people talk about seeing the pieces around. What can you tell me about them? Okay, you better write this down. Okay, I could write it down. Or I could try to remember it and not remember it. And then wish I had written it down. That sounds like more fun. Actually, I never write anything down. My question all just seems to remember everything for me. Yeah, like it should. That's handy. How does that work? I have no idea. I think it might be space magic. Uh, first piece. There's Lucian. I think he knows something. Who's Lucian? You don't know who Lucian is? He's a Majorat. He did some stuff. He stole a thing. And, and, and now Slisk is the new Lucian. According to your quest variables, you've completed Temple of Ecom. You already know who Lucian is. Besides, this is the sixth age quest, so technically you've completed Temple of Ecom anyway. Oh yeah, Lucian, big guy, skull phase, big bendy stick. That's him! Second piece. I think Steve said something about seeing a piece. Who's Steve? Yeah, Steve, the chaos element. Okay, you could have just said that. Oh no, the chaos elemental. You know him? Only by reputation, isn't he that guy who talks total gibberish? That's me. I know he has a funny accent, but I've never had any trouble understanding him. I'll do my best. Third piece. Let me think. Let me think. Oh yeah, there's Thok. Thok? You can do Thok. He has the Dungeoneering Master Cape. Yeah, Thok. Big Viking guy. What's a Viking? Fremenic? Oh, uh, uh, ex, uh, uh Fremine, 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 Fremine thingy. Could you describe him? How do you not know who Thok is? I know who Thok is. Thok is famous. Oh yeah, bare chest, beard all tied up. Kind of a dish to be honest. Let's get some of my legs dangling. Okay, Thok you, I mean, thank you. Uh, fourth piece. There is no fourth piece. Three pieces, three people. Find them all, you should be able to fix it. Funny, for some reason I'm expecting four. Ah, yeah, it was gonna be four, but we ran out of development time. Good news is, that's one less you have to find. You mean one fewer. What? One, one fewer, it's not, not one less. The, the pieces are discreet and countable. Oh, uh, whatever, Poindexter. Okay, I'll look for him. Good luck! Now, let's talk to the people. Tim. Some call him Tim. Hello! Hey! Uh, what are you two, then? The name's Tim. And I'm Crunchy. We're Crunchy and Tim. Maybe you've heard of us? Not really, no. I haven't. Yeah, yeah, no, sorry. We're the guys you know from the old website, the skeleton guy and the night guy you know. I I don't remember that. No way, that was you two? I don't remember that. Yeah. Were you this tall at the time? No, there was a bit of a mix up. Well, they did the competition for the quest rewards one of the finalists was us as bobbleheads. Can you imagine us as little people? Crazy. Uh, they drew up some concept art so that people would see how amazing we would be. But we still didn't win. When it came to our models being made, the bobblehead concept art got used by accident. So that's the story of how he ended up two feet tall. 
It sure is a sad story. So what do you do here? Basically stand there and bobble? We're environment leads. What? He said we're environment leads. What's an environment lead? Is that some sort of petrol pollution thing? How does my character know about petrol? Or gasoline? Not lead, 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 lead as in leader. Ah, text-based humor. It doesn't work in audio format. Oh, sorry, it can be difficult to tell without voice acting. Yeah, Jagex. Yeah. Yeah. What does an environment lead do? Environment artists are a kind of video game modeler who build the world. See this place? Environment artists built it. They built all of Gilor, in fact. Out of sweat and tears? Cool. Our job is to tell the environment artists what to do. It means we're real good at building stuff and breaking it down again. So you're a bit like construction foreman. That's exactly right. So what's new? Hey, Crunchy, what's up? What's up? What's up? Okay, that's enough of that. Why is my character getting on this? No. No. No, this is not trending. This is not trending. When you do it, it doesn't seem fun anymore. When anybody does it, it doesn't seem funny anymore. It's never funny. It was never funny. It never will be funny. Can you help me fix the life altar? Life altar? You need us to fix it? That sounds like a job for my crew to ex of expert environment artists. Sounds expensive. You're not wrong, Crunchy. Expensive and difficult. Could take weeks. You want us to take a look? No, I'll feed it on myself. Bye bye. Uh, creature. 9001. Not done. Sorry, what? Waiting to be done. You're waiting to be done? What, what will you be when you're done? Awesome. Shoot for the moon, half finished weird blue man thing. Environment artist. All I can think about is normals. That's a 3D modeling joke. I get it, because I, I, I do that sort of thing. But other people probably don't. See, a normal is a vector that points uh, perpendicular to a surface. And all, all, all these are made out of surfaces. Ideally quads. Anyway. Finish him. Finish him. Hello again, Tomarish! Have we met? The penguin sighs deeply. This is not the first time we have had this conversation, and it will not be the last. Who are you? I will tell you once again, only because I have nothing better to do with the time. My name is Finishif. I am, or was, agent of KGP. It's finest agent. Not only for considerable skill at infiltration and safe cracking, but because it possesses, I possess very unique capability. Yeah, what is that? I have rare condition called obliteritis. It means no one can remember interacting with me. That sounds useful for a spy. It was until the fateful day. The penguin gazes off into the distance. It was 28th of January, 2009. I was peacefully doing the job of spying when suddenly adventurers pour from every crevice of the landscape. Unable to remember interacting with me, they spot me over and over and over and over again. So humiliating! The worst abusers were banned, of course. But it was too late for me. I was exiled here because I was glitchy. 
My very greatest strength has become my greatest weakness. That is my story, friend. Take what you will from it. Yeah, we met. Who are you? Ah. Can you help me with the life altar? I know this thing of which you speak, but I'm afraid I cannot help you. Have you tried speaking to talk? He has a beard. Is the beard relevant? I do not know. I'm a penguin. Beards are a mystery to me. Oh, well, thanks. Bye bye. Okay, Beastmaster Dirtzog, why are you here? I thought you were. Oh, he is kind of big, though. Dirtzog is listening to loud music. Only tiny, tiny earbuds can hear you. But he gives you a cheery nod. Why is he here? He's not dead content. Romeo, on the other hand. A love struck Romeo sings a street serenade. That song sounds familiar. I've been down here since 2010, and I'm, I still haven't gotten used to it. Not used to what? All the references. Up in Gilinor, there are loads of references all the time, but no one ever talks about it. Oh yeah, didn't they remove you from the game because you were too blatant a reference? Yes. Down here, it's all pop culture all the time. Why do you think there's so many references in the game? There's two good reasons. One bad one, I reckon. The reason one is to show respect for a source of inspiration. All art is imitative, and well-placed reference acknowledges that, uh, that fact without disrupting the flow of work. Oh, like an homage. Yes, exactly. Good reason two is to create a sense of camaraderie with the audience. Including a reference signals to the audience that the author shares their life experiences and loves all the same things. What's the bad reason? But it's used as a substitute for actual content. Using a lazy reference because you couldn't think of a line yourself as a, a bad. Is as bad as using a cliche. One other important thing is, a perfect reference is visible to those who get it, but invisible to those who don't. Uh -huh. It's obvious that uh, it's a reference, but you don't know what is a reference name. That makes you feel excluded from an in-joke. You must hate this quest, then. Yeah. I put, you put a lot of thought into this. Surprising, isn't it? I'll be honest, though. On any other subject, I'm still the same randy old dog as always. Can you help me fix the life altar? Oh, no, I couldn't possibly. Oh, thanks for nothing, then. Have you met Lucian with, with the face? He, he might know something. Yeah, thanks. Bye bye. Uh, okay, we talked to Beastmaster. Let's talk to Claudia. I remember you. I fought you a lot during a summer event. Uh, you don't even fit in the screen. Claudia waves a massive claw at you in a cheery greeting, but she never had a chat head built, so she can't speak to you. She eats a peanut instead. Okay. Okay, Steve. Hello, I'm Steve! Who are you? As I said, I'm Steve! What kind of name is Steve? It's a perfectly reasonable name! What is your name? I'm the Lore Master. See, now that's a stupid sounding name! I didn't mean to insult you, I just... I mean, Steve seems quite mundane for a chaos... for a chaos elemental. Oh! Oh! Is it? Can I have a name like... Yeah, that's more like what I was expecting. You know what that is? That's elementalist! It's not elementalist! It is too! It's not! It is too! Is not! Is to! Okay, fine, sorry. Thank you. 
So what do you do here, Steve? I'm a journalist, as a bringer, a weaver of words. A what? I tell people about stuff that's going to happen in the future. So I can fortune tell it. Yes, sort of. I think I might have read some of your stuff on the website. Oh, you're familiar with my work? How marvelous! Yeah, but I can't understand a word of it. I was surprised you were so comprehensible in person. Ah, oh, that's all pretense, you see. Uh, to keep people interested. If you tell people things straight up, even if it's information that they need to know, they don't want to hear it. That is true. Well, if you mix it up, make it a game, uh, that's when people get really interested. I'm mostly retired now, though. Well, you still exist in the wilderness, teleporting around, teleporting other people around, being a nuisance, dropping cool stuff. Uh oh, but, but why is that? They started doing those BTS videos instead. Now I spend my time using uh, using player inspector to spy on what people are wearing. Oh, you're into fashion scape. Yes, I mean, obviously I don't wear clothes myself, but I love to see other people expressing their individuality. What do you think of fashion scape? Tell me what you really think. Uh, why can't I say I don't care? Why can't I say I don't care? Says the guy wearing cosmetic overrides. Okay, it's the best. I'm glad you like it too! So can you help me fix the life altar? The life altar? Yes! I saw a piece of it fly off and it exploded. Great, where is it? Would you like me to impart that knowledge in the form of a cryptic riddle? No. No. No, no, no. Just, just tell me what it is. It's just as well. It takes me forever to come up with those. I saw a piece got blown into the Grand Exchange. Which one? There's like three now. Yes, you know, the Grand Exchange, the GE, the Chamber of Commerce, uh, the Metro Merchanting, uh, you know, the place. Oh yeah, that Grand Exchange. Which one? See, the Grand Exchange is just a series of pipes. That is profound, yes. The piece blew in there and got stuck inside. Just ahead in the, uh, just ahead on in through that portal with all the pipes and uh, see if you can get it loose. You probably have to fill it with the pipes to get it all working again. Thanks. It's a puzzle. Bye, bye, Steve. Okay, who is next? Okay, life alter portal. Let's not go there yet. Ah, Kriara and the. Uh, wait, were you on the other side? Eh. Wait a minute. Is this a Taurus? Good to see you! That's a terrible voice. I'm trying to make a bird sounding voice, but that just. I mean, he's huge. I mean, look at him. Or is that a she? I can't tell. Anyway. Good to see. Okay, that's terrible. That's a terrible voice. Um. Good to see you. Uh, what are you doing here? Well, it looks like, old chap, we're having a nice drink while we wait to go back out in the field. Thirsty work being beaten up over and over again for stuff to disassemble for invention gains. Hey, it's what we do. You should know. You're proper good at it. Well, yeah, I had you on farm status. The rest of you, not so much. According to the analyze team, you get killed 15,000 times more than me every day. Yeah, Gary. Yeah. Come on, gentlemen, stop this fighting and act like boss monsters. Isn't that what fighting... I mean, is... I mean, don't... It's whatever. You're right, Zill. Sorry, Kree. I was only teasing. 
That's all right. I overreacted. Cheers. I keep changing their voices. Cheers. I fancy some pork scratches. Anyone want anything? Uh, another environment artist. Let's talk to Varega. I feel like I'm looping. This is <clears throat> this is a Taurus. There's Thok. Uh, okay, let's zoom out a little bit. I'm, I'm fully zoomed out and he still doesn't fit. Boom. Are you pretending to be an Ent? I talk very slowly. You're not skinny enough for an Ent. Besides, Mod Osborne made us take out all the explicit references to that film about the One Ring, you know? The one about the Lord and the giant well of lava and throwing it in? Yeah, that one. Okay, fine. How are you? Uh, to be honest, I'm pretty confused about this place, but everyone seems friendly enough. It's nice to get a bit of a break from the violence for a while. Enjoy yourself. Okay, Thok. Who's that guy? Man. Talk to man. Please don't kill me! How can I do such a thing? You adventurers are capable of far worse! No, I mean, your, your attack option isn't set, so I couldn't even attack you even if I wanted to. Or even by mistake, when I meant to pickpocket you. Because that happens sometimes. Don't pick my pocket either! Also, you don't have a pickpocket option, so don't worry. Ah. Uh. Hello, fellow one traveler! Now, what are you doing here? Thok drinking! But Thok, uh, this is where removed content goes to drink. You're not removed content. Also, where's your Dungeoneering cape? You haven't been removed, have you? No! What are you doing here? Thok like it here, good beer. Then... The, when thought when we're on the surface world, I know I won't have the courage to say this. But thought, did you ever know that you're my hero? You're everything I wish I could be. Why am I saying this? Thought know that. No, thought. Listen, you're the meaning of my life. You're the inspiration. Thought no. You know it's true. Everything I do, I do it for you. Oh, it's a, it's a song reference. It's a song reference. A song that I don't listen to. It okay, Thok no. Everyone feel this way about Thok. Good, I, I just want to let you know. Uh, life altar. <clears throat> Help with what? The life altar, Thok. I, I need to fix it. What is that? It's like a big rock with a picture on it, it exploded. Ah! I know this! You know where any of the pieces went? Uh, Thok CP's going to big room of beating. You mean beta room? Thok's friend Max in there, he tell you. Where is that? Put a big glowing circle next to unfinished looking blue boxes. Okay, I'll find and talk to Max. First have a drink with Doc. Okay, dokie. Okay, bye now. Bye, Doc. Okay, uh, Sueros, who is that? That's Zaros, not Sueros. Also, think of me what? Don't think of me what? Hello, good to see you. What are you doing down here? Have we met? Yeah, though I look a bit different. 
uh, out of the rig, I suppose. I'm the puppeteer that wasn't thinking about what. You remember from Love Story? That was you and that thing. I don't even remember that. Ah, very much. Uh, I would say CGI is only a tool to help things along. For real impact, real reactions, we need a real actor. Well, keep up the good work. Uh, Sueros. Don't you have the wrong name? Yo, well met and stuff. You're being very familiar. You think of Zoros, don't you? Oh, you're not? No. Who are you then? My name is Sueros. I come from like an alternate Gilador or something. Or like a parallel world? Yeah, exactly. A world like yours, dude, except for uh, one crucial difference. What's the one crucial difference? On my world, I'm like unbelievably awesome. Really? Totes, man. Can you give me an example? Well, you, you know how, like, in your world, everything fell apart when that nasty old Zamorak betrayed and murdered Zaros? I d Spoilers! I've not done that quest yet! Vaguely, yeah. No, I've not done it! I've not done that quest! Oh, I, I, should, I should be doing these in chronological order, shouldn't I? Well, in my world, when Zamora confronted me, I just, like, pulled out my guitar and totally shredded this sweet solo which made the very earth bleed simultaneous tears of joy and sorrow. Then me and Zimzam hugged it out, and me and him and Hazzy have been uh, best bros ever since. Consequently, my total sweet empire never fell, and as a consequence, the people in my world live in, like, complete peace and harmony and stuff. So why are you here, then? Say so what? If your world is so perfect, what are you doing here? Well, you see, I'm perfect, right? So, yeah, you say so. Right, and being perfect is, like, awesome and stuff and totally sweet. You say so? Right, but like, there's one problem with being perfect, you know. What's that? Well, like, the heart of drama is conflict, right? Anticipation, tension, confrontation, resolution, right? Yeah, uh-huh, yeah. And like, being like, totally perfect and a genius and everything, there's just isn't any real conflict in my world, and it's no drama. So you're saying you're bored. Well, like, I'm a great writer and stuff, so I can, like, keep people entertained with my amazing plays and novels and albums and stuff, you know? So there's that. Sometimes, though, you just gotta keep it real, you know? Like, in my world, no one ever dies or suffers or is, like, even slightly uncomfortable in any way. Here, though, it's, like, total disaster, like, all the time, man. It's very entertaining. I'm glad we amuse you. You're welcome. Okie dokie. See, portal. Wait, 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 wait. Apropos. This is absurd. What is? I have the wrong color. What do you mean? This is clearly just Hanamus' character model. They didn't even bother to recolor it. Maybe you and the other guy, what's his name, just look really similar. It's not like the humans in this game are that distinct from each other either. Wrong. It's obvious from canon that Inu Junka have weirdly varied patterns and colors on the skin and the chances of Hanimus and Apropos looking identical are so remote as to be particularly non-existent. Besides, Apropos is the female and most races in the world are highly sexually dimorphic. 
And why am I even carrying a lens? I'm in a drinking establishment. This is an unacceptable lore file. I'm gonna walk away now. Uh, environment artist. Karasi. I remember you kind of... I have your sword. Yeah, Karasi. Hey, I visited the lore master. It's well wicked to see you again. <clears throat> I'm sorry I let you die. Uh, what? <clears throat> hey, I'd save the fit nerdy bit for Toddy and all, so I get you. What? What does that even mean? Besides, I'm sure you'll see me again sometime, maybe in some quest you've not done yet or something. What? Sorry, no spoilers, mate. Uh, Araxor. Don't think a newspaper is going to cut it. Also, why is Araxor moving at like 15 FPS? Bartender. Sanic! Can you believe her? I can't believe her. Whoa. 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 See, I'm used to this Zanuck here. Who is this? That's like Yoda. I mean, can you believe her? I can't. I can't believe her. What's she got that I haven't got? Nothing. She's got nothing. I just can't believe her. Who are you talking about? Zanuck! Well, aren't you Zanuck, both of you, somehow? Oh, that's nice of you to say. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Are you mocking us? I think they're mocking us. I'm not, I, I don't understand. We're talking about her. The new one, the new Zanuck. The graphical rework. Oh, okay. She thinks she's so great. Oh, look at me. I'm Zanuck. I'm so pretty. She'll find out. I was angry when you replaced me, but they hated you. They hated me. They hated me so much. Some of them, some of them even killed me. I'm so sorry they hurt you. I'll just leave you to whatever this is. Ah, oh, Lucian, I remember you. Oh, hey, man, what's up? Uh, we need to talk. Do we know each other? Yeah, we, we've been in quests together. Yeah, know each other? You killed my friend? Yeah, you killed, um, Duradel. And, um, um, Burthorpe Slayer Master Dude, whose name I can't remember at the moment. Uh, what was that, man? When you stole this old stone of Joss and tried to use it to become a god. Oh, you mean the ritual of the Majorok. And while got to sleep, you, you, you monster! You remember what happened at the end of the ritual of the Majorot? Of course. You, you, your your anger brought down the wrath of the dragonkin. <clears throat> oh, yeah. <laughs> that scaly dude was all in my face, and I was like, Oh, no, get it off! Oh, I'm dead! Oh, good times. Good times. My friends are dead! Nah, you're looking at it all wrong. It ain't like that down here. What do you mean? Oh, I'm dead, right? Yeah. Well, here we are talking. Yeah. Up there, it's all just a game, man. Nothing but a game. Fretful hour and all that Shakespeare and all that stuff. Down here, death don't mean nothing. I wish I could introduce you to Hazelmere. He'd tell you. Hazelmere's alive? Yeah, well, no, I mean, it, it, it's complicated. He was here for a while, and we were buzzed, man. I mean, we were tight. We used to hit up uh, TDs together and all that, shoot some pool, clean torso, good times. 
And then he got a part of Nomad's Elegy, so now he's technically dead, except, you know, he's back, so maybe he's, you know, kind of alive in a way. I don't know, man, I just miss him, you know? And I now have to clean Taurus all by myself. Me, I don't think I'm going back. Majra got no afterlife, see, on account of being divine, so if I'm dead, I'm dead. No takes his backsies. Yeah, I see. Besides, it's the sixth age now, right? The sixth age? Sixth age, man, it's like a philosophy. It means the past is the past. Live for the now. Hakuna Matata, Carpe Diem, YOLO, forgive and forget, you know what I mean? I guess. Hey, good for you, man, but uh, enough about that old stuff. Okay, Life Altar. You're trying to put the Life Altar back together, right? Yeah, that's right. That's the sort of thing I do. Well, you're not going to believe this, man. I had one of the pieces right in my hands, but then I lost it. You lost it? Well, I say lost it, but it was more like stolen. Well, exactly stolen. Yeah, exactly stolen. Someone stole it from you. Yeah, man, and then he didn't even do anything with it. He just stashed it in his bank and went off to do something else. The bank? You know, the bank. The place where dudes keep all their climbing boots and hand cannons. Oh, yeah, I have one of those. Mine is full of junk, to be honest. I really ought to clean it out. Yep. Hey, man, frugality is for losers. I have a better idea, man. You should demand more bank space. I will. Good idea. But hey, man, getting back to the subject at hand and all that, again, the altarpiece is going to be a cakewalk. It's someone else's bank, man. You can't just open up someone else's bank. It won't be right, for one thing. Plus, you don't know the bank pin. So I need a bank pin? Oh, no, it won't be that easy. You're going to have to break in. Whose bank is it? Who stole from you? You won't believe this man. It was the old. It was the one, the only, the wise old man. But he's alive. He shouldn't be down here. The wise old man, the notorious bank robber. That's right. He did that way back when. The very same man. How ironic. Actually, it's not ironic. If you want that piece, you're going to have to break in. And if you're going to break in, you're going to need a crack team, a specialist, or something. Why don't you hit on in the bank, case the joint and, uh, and, and all that. Where's the bank? Through that portal right next to me, look for obstacles and barriers and stuff. Then take a look around the bar and see if you can find anyone to help out. Thanks. Uh, not much, man. Whatever that means. Did I miss someone over there? Talk to Bandos' remains? Yeah, we super deadified him. The ruined stone head seems to be humming happily to itself. Hey, Bandos, where's your head at? Dot, dot, dot. Sorry. Uh... Pink Black Dragon Head? Pink Black Dragon Head, okay. Uh, well, we were going this way, talking to everybody, but it looks like I've looped around again. That's neat how they do this. It just loops and loops and, whoa. I think I hit the loop point there. Yeah, there's Sueros. Ooh, talk to the cabbage. I missed the cabbage. This be of important cabbage troop into acting, rehearsal, busy, busy do. Okay, they're, they're busy acting. Is that something? No, that's not something. I'm uh, back at Bandos' remains. And yeah, there's the 15 FPS Araxor. There's the Xanax. And here we go hitting the loop again, right? Yep. You think they could smooth that out a little bit? 
Uh, where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? I'm going there? Okay, let's stop the infinite looping. Uh, we got bartenders. Talk to the bartender. Hello, mate. What can I get you? Well, you have. Tea. Sure. Okay, so that that's this side. Um, Mod Raven. What? Hello, Mod Raven. Can I get the Ravensworn title without searching the Elf City? Too much effort? Well, I suppose I can spread my Ravens around a bit. That No, that's not what I said! There should be 1,000 Ravens, each appearing 1,000 days after the other. This is getting silly now. It will take you centuries to find them! <laughs> oh, yeah, bye. Hail me! Oh yeah, Gothics. We never spoke to Gothics. Can I help you? Yeah, you're Gothics. You're shorter than you used to be. I mean, I used to be able to walk on your face, and it, 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 you, you're like the your, your your face was like a mountain. Oh, it's a fanboy. It's good to see you again. You, you do realize Gothics is just a character. What do you mean? I'm an actor. Gothics is a character that I play. But... This is why I hate doing genre work. The player base take their fictional works so was way too personally and seriously. I should never have taken the role of the, this role in the first place. I'm a classically trained thespian! I believe I was only cast as Gothic due to my appearance. Yeah, you do look like him. I fear I've become typecast. It's quite impossible to find a work elsewhere in Gilanor now. Well, I mean, your character's dead. Can you help me find the life altar? I mean, fix the life altar? Is it a problem which can be solved with superb acting sensibilities and a gift for evoking pathos? Uh, probably not. Perhaps another can help you with your task then? The Chaos Elemental Paths. I believe his name is Steve. Okay, thanks. Who's this? Captain Haskell. Do I know you? Captain Haskell reeks of beer or sugary soda pop if you're playing in Portuguese. <laughs> okay. Okay. What's the point of Uh, sorry, what? Uh, he talks like I talk. I I'm not sure what conversation I just got into here, but I think I already regret it. That was the physicist. The physicist's master. I could stay engaged with just proper skills. Of twin perceptions. This is a what what? Little imposter! What's the guy have we got? There's XP is never care about him that! I gave him that! I even came back with a bear deal to for them. Oh he's got no that's good enough! Just because I'm not a cute little nude with greedy eyes and triple voice and smile and such up the world. Dot 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 dot. Why won't you love me? He's working through some issues right now. Best leave him to it. Uh, let's see. Okay, there, there's the bobbleheads. 
Uh, Romeo, unfinished thing. Environment artist. Okay, I think we've spoken to everybody. And, uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. That's an environment artist. Okay. There's the Xanax. Uh, okay, so we got Grand Exchange Maintenance. We got a portal over there. I can't see what it is. Life Altar Portal. So I need to go there. And that's where I go when I have all the th all three pieces. Um, and then there's uh, portals over here. What are they? Central Bank. Beta Room. The beat em up room. Small Portal. What? What do these small portals do? Uh, okay, um... Here's the thing. We're like at 2 hours and 19 minutes. It's, uh, it's getting late. I have another live stream later today. This is one of those quests that's gonna have to be... A two-parter! And we will, uh... We'll continue. We will continue this. I don't want to say finish. We will continue this next week. Uh, can I return? Let me do an experiment first. Send you back to Gilador. I want to do that. Okay, that goes there. And scan disk. And I come back. Okay. Wait a minute. Can I just teleport out of here? I can? What? I can teleport out of here. Okay. So, okay, now, now I need to put the very specific quest items in my bank in such a way that I remember what I was doing next week. Um, the problem is, the first page is insane. What if, uh, what if we unlock the interface, go back to the bank, make this a little bit wider, so we can fit another tab, drag an item onto this icon. Okay. <clears throat> Let's drag the disk of returning. There we go. Now I have a tab for current quests in progress. There we go. Uh, is there anything else that I need to put in there? Looks like no. Shouldn't that have been consumed with the um, completion of the quest? Let's wear that. Destroy. I can get another one from a dork. I don't think I need to. Oh yeah, let this... Check the thing. Okay, we need to make this a little bit wider. Not that wide, though. Eh, that works. Lock it, so I don't mess things up. Okay, and then... That's there. That's there. That's there. Yeah. I have a little too much extra space on this side, but I'm, 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 I'm trying to ignore that. Oh no, my neat organization was messed up by, by adding extra columns. <sighs> uh, okay, 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 don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. West stuff. Yeah. How many times can I have? I wonder. Oh, that's pretty... Okay, okay, okay. Just wind it up. Wind it up. Wind it up. Okay. So we will continue the Gower quest next week. Hopefully finish? Question mark? Uh, in the meantime, did this brighten your day in any way, shape, or form whatsoever? I mean, it did mine. All the references, all the in-jokes, including the ones I don't get, which is like half of them. But if this brightened your day in any way, shape, or form whatsoever, pass it on. Find somebody you care about. Make them laugh. Brighten their day. Make them smile. It's the gift that keeps on giving. And with that, I will see you when I see you.